All right, guys, we're back with electronic check cards. I just realized if you're dragging a long line, well, it's going to be dragging in this water, and then pretty soon it's all wet and disgusting. If you said, how do you know that, uh, I've done it before. All right, look, so i got a dog way over there. I'm going to get gone, and he knows this trajectory. Angus! I don't hear him coming. Yay! Hi, Tony. Hi, Karen. Oh, and he gave me the shake off. Oh, he came great big, though. I could hear him coming. Unlike last night when he slammed into me. I could hear him coming. I could hear him splashing. And you've got to learn to do that. And, and especially with shepherds, uh, you know, if they think they're being left behind. And if you said, well, I never leave her behind. You need to start. Because that's what makes him really run faster. Oh, look, he's doing his, he's doing grass dancing. Yes, native grass dancing. He's already got the little dancing moves. Oh, really species. Trying to not act too entertained with his antics, though. Yes, Tony, you know that. You act too entertained with their antics. Well, the little antics start getting worse. Uh, he likes to do grass tunneling, though. So I'll make him think I'm just standing right here. I'm going to be on the 30. I'm taking long, long steps. Yeah, this is working. <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> so you are, you know, and that's why people need to keep a training log, Melissa, if you're there. You know, I don't need to because I can't remember anything anyway. I even forget to write it down. But, you know, I'm saying to myself, how much default am I getting? It's just second nature for me. But people need to write if I'm not getting any default, if I'm getting what people consider Angus, yay! Uh, oh, he checks back on me, then I'm failing. They're not checking back. They're, yeah, that's an indication that they're going to go the other way. Oh, look at the fish. Oh, he sees shoe bottom down there. And this is where he, this is where he fails in life. He doesn't, he, when you put something in front of him, this is his reaction. He's going to try to, oh, she loves him. Look, now she's getting down. She's getting down to try to kind of stalk on him. Look, now he's laying down. He's laying down. That's his strategy uh, to deal with her. But his strategy is going to be to take off running in a second. And so I'm going to preempt that. Angus! Yay! All I did was cause him to run. Oh, see him, see him, you see him go flat? You see him go flat? He thought he was getting run on. He thought he was going to get run roughshod over. He went flat. He does have a flat. He's got a flat. And he's giving it the shake off. He said, what, what made him go? The flat. Oh, she, she finished standing him off. Look at her. Oh, she's awful, Tony. Look at her. Oh, Tony, she's awful. Remember the first day when I got her, Tony? I don't think I can up, I could probably share that video. All right, so I'm saying to myself, I'm finna change his proximity. I'm turning my dial. Okay, oh, look at him go. Yeah, she's gonna try to beat him down. Oh, he come back to mama. He come back to mama. Oh, look at him go, all crookedy tail. And that's, that's, he's, for a moment there, I don't know if you're there, Tony. I know you like that one drop tail video, but that's, he went drop tail for a minute. He went drop tail. Oh, she loves him. Oh, she stays by his cage now. Oh, look at her. She's got a boyfriend. Finally, somebody that can handle her. <laughs> Finally, Tony, someone that can handle her. Angus! Angus! Oh, I'll tell you, I, you couldn't see it, but I turned his ass around. Yay! Angus! Yay! And he gave me the flyby, so I drug him back over with my electronic check cord. Oh, she's absolutely awful, Tony. Oh, she's ruining my whole life, Tony. I can't even sleep in my own bed. My feet are crushed or cramped because she has to take up the whole bed practically. Look at her. Look at her, Tony. She's got to be 90 pounds. Look at her. At least 80. Anyway, but I have the ability with this check cord to interject. And because I train that dog at high speed, that's why it works. That's why it works. And I let him know. I want you to watch his ears. Get your 
Let me beat you down. Let me beat you down. <laughs> yeah, that's a command you have to have <laughs> with one like this. And it basically means I'll blitz Craig. And he understands what that. That's why he went flat when that dog came around the corner. He thought she was getting ready to blitz Craig his ass. So his solution was to go flat. It's a very, very complex and interesting case. Right, let me get through this wire. I've already changed, I had to change my socks like 20 times today, Tony. It was just pouring, pouring, pouring. Thank God, though. The pond is full. The fish have plenty of room to stretch their fins. I have dreams sometimes that I see this clear water. I told him, he's like, oh God, <laughs> too much information. But it's full of alligators. I don't know if you've ever had that dream, Tony. But you look in the water, the water's very, very clear. And then, oh, I don't know where, shoe, shoe bottoms run off, Tony. Tony, could you call down to the office and put in a report? Because she's gone. <laughs> she's gone, Tony, please. Please, text the office. Uh, no, uh, send uh, uh, a teletype. Send a teletype over to the office and tell them, shoe bottom is missing. <laughs> At which that point they'll say, who cares? Oh yeah, she's gone. She's gone. She's got to come out of nowhere, probably. Oh, you missed it, Mike. He was playing and everything. He was playing and everything. It's a very, very... Oh, here she comes. Oh, he's going to make himself aware. I'm going to make sure he sees her by going this way. Because I don't want her to bum rush him again. Well, she's like Casper the Friendly Ghost. Mixed with the little girl from uh, the movie The Exorcism. <laughs> That's who she is, Tony. Yeah, that's how I can best describe her. But you can see his facial expression is changing when he's got the ears forward. I can bend him back. I can bend him back. But I'm going to continue to do that. Oh, she's absolutely awful. Yeah, Casper the Friendly Ghost meets Linda Blair from The Exorcist. That's, that's my dog. She's absolutely awful. Oh, look at her. Flapping her face all around, getting him going all, getting him all stirred up. Anyway, you guys, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just honestly amazed how well this dog is doing. But, and I'm honestly amazed she bought him is enamored with it. And right before I let her out, uh, you know, she was laying right by his cage, face by face by face. And he's not growling or doing, he isn't, you know, and it's, it's, it's I think we have to understand that aggression is, a complex thing. I'm I'm very very aggressive towards people that I think are hitting dogs with constant. But yet I'm generally speaking I'm very kind and go out of my way for people. Go farther out of my way for people than any other people practically do. Not any other people, but at least half the people. So you have to say, well, the aggression is sort of situational, and this isn't that. It's yeah, I would like to find out more, but it's, it's a, you know, I said in the beginning, it was a very, very good at fence fighting. But you can see just by virtue, and if you said, how does, how do you bend, systemically, 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 I can't, I can't tell people that, and it can't just be, okay, I'm going to wait until I think I need it to do, look at her, Tony, this is right before bedtime, oh, good Lord, look at her. She doesn't even need to go down to the pond. She's just playing there. She's probably trying to catch frogs or something. Look at her. She's awful. Oh, she's absolutely awful. No concern whatsoever. Oh, she'll fall down in there in a minute. All right, look. And you see, he want. If you said, why does he come back? He wants to. Oh, look at her. She's getting her evil face on. She's finna go on him. Look. Mm hmm If you said, where are you going? Back up against something. I'll look at her, Tony. She is awful. All right, guys. I will be back tomorrow. Tune in tomorrow, Tony. Anyway, uh, cancel the uh, cancel the report. Shoe bottom has been shoe bottom has been located. So cancel cancel the report. <laughs> but but Tony, but Tony, uh, keep it on the speed dial. She she can take off and it. Look at her. Oh, she is awful. Digging out the gate. Oh, she's awful. And then, of course, my lawn people brought my penny saver down. They're so thoughtful. Yeah, no, no. When they came to cut the grass, they made sure and brought my penny saver down. <laughs> Stop. Yeah, she actually dug the gate out. Oh, now she's digging up a mole. <laughs> Look at her. Yeah, Auntie Tony's going to babysit for you if Kelly has to go out of town. 
Auntie Tony's gonna come right over and get you. <laughs> Auntie Tony's like, Tony's like, block! <laughs> All right, you guys. Yeah, I'm amazed though. Her, her, you know, if she had a different attitude towards him, but I don't know, I'm sure you've seen it before too, Tony. They can kind of, she's just kind of a squishy face and she knows she's a squishy face. She sees a commonality in him that she doesn't see in the other ones. Let's put it that way. They all have a much longer nose. He, on the other hand, is oh so handsome with his squishy face. Uh oh, she doesn't like that though. He better watch out. She's gonna get mad in a minute. Watch out. Yeah, look, she's big and busy digging for the moles. Look at her, Tony. She's awful. Because you know how, and I'm sure you already know this, Tony, when it gets wet, the moles start kind of surfacing. I watch how she does it, though. Like she has to tip her head at a very odd angle to dig. She has to, like... She's awful. Get her, Tony. This is what she does. He's out there. He's eating something. Else. <laughs> Tony's like, what is this? All right, you guys, I gotta go. I gotta go, uh... Get them put up. I got Angus has got to get his dinner. I feed him all day though. All day. That's how I get him back in there. I'm not going to start demanding he go in the crate. There's no need. I say get in the easy bake oven. I throw the little thing in the back. He runs right in there. See, he's got a little dilemma right now. If he's going to go from there, if I get, if I want to come from there, and I, you do need to do some of this. Where he's going to have to go around the corner. Watch, Angus. Oh, he's going just as slow as he can. He saw that white thing. He almost picked it up earlier. That uh, that was how George fixed the pump. That's what you can kind of expect, the random PVC pipe laying around. <laughs> All right, you guys, I'll be back tomorrow.